Okay guys, so being called out to this job this morning. It's the first job of the day and we have a water leak scenario on this unmentary cylinder as you can see. So that's the cold water supply coming to the cylinder, going through this multifunctional valve uh, that's got a PRV connected to it as well. Coming down, the PRV connection is going into this tundish as well as the temperature and pressure release valve from the cylinders connected into there. Uh, then the cold water supply pipe comes down and it's going into the cylinder as a cold feed just in there. We have the coil, primary coil flow and return connected there, immersion heater, cylinder start, secondary return is capped off and then we have hot water outlet at the top. There is a T on the cold water pipe as you can see. You were expecting an expansion vessel somewhere in there. Yep, so there's an expansion vessel there. The area is very damp as you can see. Although somebody installed a radiator in here. That's nice and warm. I can't keep up with it. Okay, so. The task at hand is to firstly identify which valve's leaking. Whether this valve or that valve leaking. Let's just have a feel of this hot water pipe. Nice and hot, somebody's using it, I can hear the water going out of it, or through it, I should say. Uh, so if the water in the cylinder is nice and hot, one way to determine whether it's this valve or that valve leaking is to just have a feel of this water that's leaking, freezing cold. So if it's cold water, that tells us that it's not coming out of the cylinder, it's actually leaking from that top valve there. So it's just a matter of replacing that valve. We need to also check how we're going to isolate this cold water supply because I can't see. Let's have a look. I can't see the isolation point on here. So I'm open this box in. That's not good. What's going on in here? Okay. Ah, oh, main stop tap. Perfect. Two. Good. Let's just this back in here for now. Broken up. So that goes in there, so we just need to go get a new PRV and install it, and that should kill that problem. Perfect. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments, and I'll try to get back to you. Thanks a lot. Take care. Bye.